Mic check one, two, and I'm live. This here is the first episode of my program called Lifeline, and I want to start by paying big respect to every content creator out there, especially on YouTube, people that I consume their content. The reason why I'm making this shout out is because today I've had a first hand experience of how difficult it is to create content. It's been a while since I wanted to start this program, but I've had challenges with what camera to use, what settings of camera to use, what kind of lighting should I get, how do I set my lighting, how do I capture my room, because there are so many information in this room that I would have loved to be on my background or to be in my video, but I can't squeeze them all in in one frame. There are so many challenges that are giving me avenues to procrastinate, and that's why I've not started this program since. And then I, I, I imagine people that create amazing content that I consume, I, I imagine what they go through and how many takes they, they did to get it to the finished product that we watch on YouTube. And some of us that consume the content, like we don't even know how, how much effort people put through this. And you never can tell until you try to create yours. And big respect man big shout out because i know how difficult it is for me to put this program together and i'm imagining what it takes all of you to put even um, some programs that i see on youtube that are way more sophisticated than what i'm giving out now you know sometimes we watch content and we don't even comment we don't even subscribe we don't even like the videos or sometimes we don't like the information or the person's point of view and then we leave such a negative comment or we, you know, we, we use the dislike button. After starting this, my program, I, I think my perspective has changed because now I know how difficult it is to put things together. Whenever I see people create their content, I don't think I'll be too quick to grade them the way I usually do. To even gather your train of thoughts together and present it, it's not easy. You know, to even figure out what to talk about and how to talk about it. If I'm discussing one-on-one, -on -one, if I'm teaching people one-on-one, -on -one, it's way easier. Like, there you can use informal language. You don't even necessarily need to prepare lecture notes because everything you're speaking about is right there in your head. But when you're trying to create content for a content that will fit every kind of audience or yeah like a larger audience you know people that you've not met before people that may not understand your informal language and it's, it's much more difficult and trust me everybody anyone who makes content there on youtube for people to consume is the person person rocks person rocks for real so that being said please do like share and subscribe to my channel it helps to encourage me to keep making content like this. Cheers.